Hi, hey. welcome to Go Deleo Realty. I'm Realtor Rob. I'm Samantha. And today's Monday. It is indeed. It's time to get motivated. Yeah. And like every Monday, we want to start off with something good. Yes. And so do we have something good to tell everybody? Well, heck, it's spring break. That's good, It right? is spring break. Yes. That is very good. Our spring break always starts off well. But you know why it's so good for me? Why is it so good for you? Baseball. Oh, yes. Baseball. Opening season, yes. opening games are just around the corner. Fantasy baseball, I already got oh. uh, I'm in fantasy baseball. We got a draft coming up. I'm not on a team. You didn't oh. invite me this year. Hey, if you'd like to join a fantasy <laughs> baseball team, just Man. comment below. We'll send you a link because uh, uh, Samantha wants to get in on baseball mm -hmm. league. Yeah, I love fantasy baseball. Yep, it's a lot of fun. But uh, why else is spring break great for us? Well, we went and got our daughter and brought her home That's this right. week, last weekend, so yeah. she gets to be home with us and the dogs and enjoy family time this week for spring break. Ah, so that's looking always forward good. To it. Yep. Yeah. Yep. We're going to have a lot of fun this uh, this week while she's home. Mm -hmm. So hopefully uh, if we're with you, uh, if you have kids at home and you got great plans, we'd like to hear what those plans mm -hmm. are for your spring bake uh, or break. Break. Uh, make sure you comment below because uh, we want to hear something good from you. We got a couple of updates. Mm -hmm. uh, the first oh, one yeah. is talking about mortgage rates. Yes. They have dropped to an all-time low last week. You like the visual there. I do yeah. like the visual. That's good. That's better than the character generated uh, images that we would put on. Do that again. Oh, see, that's nice. Now, the 10-year Treasury uh, note posted record-setting declines. Yes. yes. The uh, interest rate stood at 0.76% and had never been below 1.1% before. So, that's pretty good. Uh, Freddie Mac reported that the interest rate for the 30-year fixed uh, rate mortgage mm -hmm. dipped to 3.29% for the week ending March 5th. Wow, that's yeah. crazy. I mean, that's that's super low. Yeah. Now, a lot of you may think, wow, this is going to impact our um, you know mortgage rates for uh, new buyers. Mm -hmm. Ho hold on a minute. We don't necessarily see that happening. Yeah lenders are very concerned with the level of demand and we mm -hmm. do see a lot of buyer demand already so if the interest rates were to go any lower it would be a lot like drinking out of a fire hose yep so uh think of it this way uh, you've been in a public place mm -hmm. and you went on wi-fi right right and it seemed like everybody else was on wi-fi oh yeah and what was that experience like slow very slow yes and so uh, lenders are very concerned about that yeah, so yeah, that they may hold the interest rates mm -hmm. not drop them but hold them uh, because they don't want to get to a situation where they can't handle the demand you get totally bogged down that way huh? yep yeah yep and it could true. be a miserable experience so makes sense yeah don't think that everything is going to drop uh, just because the Treasury note has dropped so yeah. just keep an eye on that we don't see it dropping uh, as the demand continues to spike uh, now, speaking of demand, uh, spring is, is here, and we expect bidding wars to yes, come out. Yes, that yep. will happen. Yeah, why will that happen? Well, it's low inventory, and it's high demand, and so there are going to be several people saying, hey, I want that house, and so it's just going to become a bidding war. That, you're absolutely I mean, right. Simple as that. And the January uh, st stats came out. We already saw very strong January. Prices were up. Uh, and uh, home sales were up mm -hmm. and the listings were down quite a bit. Now that happened in January. We mm -hmm. saw the same thing happening in February, but we don't have the uh, February uh, actuals uh, yeah. yet. Now, there's a big wild card in the market. What is that? That would be the coronavirus. Mm -hmm. Yep. And we just heard today that there is the first uh, Frisco area uh, incident yeah. uh, of the coronavirus. Uh, you know, we hope and pray that there won't be more, yeah. uh, but likely there will be because uh, this this young man uh, actually got it from traveling to California. He did. And, you know, it's not, I don't believe it's a sheer panic just yet. Yeah. And I do believe everyone needs to wash their hands. Um, but but it's definitely something to look out for. It's yeah. just a, let, let's see what, what's going on. Yep. You know? Yep. Now we hope that uh, this is short lived, mm -hmm. and and if it is, we expect the uh, uh, buyers to swoop on down in droves. Absolutely. Uh, but for now, uh, do the right thing. Wash your hands. Uh, you know, don't touch a lot of things, and if you do, just make sure you're clean. 
uh, you know, I, you know what I liked? I saw on the news mm. uh, where they had that, that health um, uh, doctor yeah. coming in and said, don't touch your, your face, don't, yeah. t- don't touch your lips and everything. It's a good challenge. Somebody uh, on Facebook today said that he discovered that not touching his face was yeah. harder than quitting smoking. Wow. He's, he's <laughs> discovering <laughs> that it is really hard to do now yeah. that he's been made, uh, now that, that challenge has been placed on him. That would be a great but challenge. It is we hard. like to hear what you're doing <laughs> to challenge yourself and to keep you safe with the coronavirus. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but anyway, stay safe, stay yes. clean. Um, a quick, quick uh, overview on the market. Uh, we did see last week 199 new listings. That's, That's a good sign. Yeah, that is great. That more than doubled That's week over week. That's 103% improvement. Wow. That's yeah, great. That's good. Uh, so we're up to 8,510 listings in the local market, uh, which is about 7% up over week over week. Mm-hmm. Uh, median price and the median days stayed flat. So we're still at about 415000 for wow. the median price in the market, local okay. market, and 39 days on the market. So flat hey, but that's that's better than when it was 80 90, 90 yeah days, we you know? yep it's getting there yep and we do see buyers in the market so an increase in the listings will help out those buyers yes uh, now the number one reason uh, to list your house right now if you're considering it is absolutely timing and for reasons we've already talked about uh, number one, buyer demand is extremely strong yes we've been talking about that lots of buyers in the market the, uh, the other thing is that the supply is at historical lows. So even though we've seen uh, you know, more listings, it's still historically low. Mm-hmm. Just keep in mind, we saw a doubling of, uh, week over week of the listings on the market. Those people are ahead of the curve from the com- competition. So if you're thinking about listing your house, Right now is the right time because we are seeing the market start to increase on the inventory side. You don't want to be caught at the end of the at at the end of that wave. Okay, so let's end with a motivational quote for today, and that sometimes we're tested not to show our weaknesses, but to discover our strengths. And you and I talked about that, and we really started thinking about it. I look at that as being the opportunity for us Mm -hmm. Uh, because just like the market right now yeah you know we've seen that the that that is on a decline huge decrease in the uh in the stock market Mm -hmm. and you know there's a lot of woe is me going on uh but here here here's the opportunity as i see it okay you can sit there and look at all the reasons how and why we fail or we don't overcome the challenges and obstacles, you can do that. Yeah. That's pretty easy. Yeah. Or you can take the opportunity to look at yourself, look at your strengths, and how can you leverage those uh, to win and be successful in, 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 in the challenge of today. So what are some opportunities with the downfall you just mentioned? Well, I think that there you, you can keep an eye on the uh on the market Mm -hmm. and do your due diligence because i think you're going to see some great american products and companies Mm -hmm. that have uh, traditionally been a good bet that might be looking low right now oh yeah but now's the time to take advantage of that low price point that's true get in knowing that we will overcome like we always do the market always bounces back and uh that that would be a, a good investment that's true Good, good thought. The other thing is look at your personality, look at your strengths, um, and and how you can leverage those um, just to be more successful, right? So you and I know that our personalities are different, <laughs> but together we complement each other. So yes, look for ways how you guys can complement each other at home, how you can leverage your strengths, and you can continue to be successful in all the things that you do. Well, there you go. Sound good? Sounds great. Glad you tuned in. I'm Rob DeLeo. (laughs) And I'm Samantha. And we are Go DeLeo Realty. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Hey, if you like this video, make sure you follow us. We can be found on uh, Frisco Area Homes on Facebook and on Instagram Mm -hmm. and on YouTube at Go DeLeo Realty. And you can also follow us on our blog uh, and we'll put all the links below. 
There you go. Sounds great. Uh, give us a thumbs up and Keep comment up. below. We appreciate <laughs> it. Oh, hearts are good too. Oh yeah, hearts and ring-a-dings of the bells. <laughs> yep. We love it all. And thank you again for following. <laughs> Bye.